Hey yo, it's me. Oxygen not included. Let us do stuff. So we, we where we left off last time was I guess we were starting to get or planning for large amounts of lettuce. We were setting up these uh, pretty free farms that would allow us to get free and near infinite lettuce. The only thing we'll have to work on at some point is uh, heat retention. Let's just, uh, yep, here we are. We made these three pockets of, uh, you know, water. Each of them filled with, was it 12 water seeds? So that at some point, granted these guys allowed me, we would be able to plant 12 water leaves. Or did I just put 11 so that I could actually get the... I don't know. Anyways, the point is, you know, these guys plant water leaf, the water leaf grows. I, at some point, probably set up some sort of shipping automation in here. The lettuce is delivered straight to the cooling plant. And, yeah, et voila. So, this thing will be self sufficient as long as it has heat. And I don't remember the exact calculations I did last time, but I think what I reached was like 1 or 12 wild plants should be able to feed like 6 duplicates, provided all of the other resources were taken care of. Which, you know, could be another issue, but we'll see to that later. We will make sure that we get everything done. And I also had to just make sure to actually pick up all of the lettuce around. Now, oh yeah, we hadn't discovered this volcano, which I was planning to do. And I believe we see, yeah, we sealed up this area, which had what? Yeah, four, five successful plants, and this one, which was actually no, this one should be okay. No, um, because it's oxygen. Ah, well, not the big issue. It's just, uh, Everything should be nice, and beyond this, we also need to, you know, uh, look into power, because we don't really have a stable source of it right now. We produce some with the spawn, but due to, like, low oxygen consumption, it's not really sustainable, or, I mean, it's barely enough to keep the desalinators running, which... Granted, they ha don't have to run full time in order for this to work, but uh, I want them to be able to work full time. Which means we're going to have to produce more oxygen. And even now we are... Oh no, th 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 this is a problem. We're actually not producing enough hydrogen to power the gas pumps at this point. Good thing we have the manual generators, I guess. Ah, set it to 50 or something. You take care of it. And okay. Now here comes something I'm... I think that this wild hatch area is both a waste and potentially harmful to the stability of this game, so I might have to kill all of them off. 
you know, uh, only my And just enable harvest of everything down here. Hey, you know what? Enable harvest of everything around the base. Even this. Though, uh, you know, will most likely not do it. Hmm. But, yeah. Okay, so, power. At this point, I feel like we are able to live just off of the, you know, lice loaf production we have, so that we could potentially add another duplicate if we want to do so. I think we might do that. Beyond that, uh, the other sources of power we of course have is um, coal generator and wood burner at the moment. Coal generator I don't really want to use, it creates heat and carbon dioxide. So, hmm. Whereas the wood burner, also same problems and just less effective. Now, okay, let's. Oh, no, I'm at the hatch. Well, we have, of course, the. the what is it, the organic hatch? No, it's called the sage hatch. What do these guys eat? Okay, it's just... Basic uh, food items and a few other things. Which I don't think I'm going to give away. Or let them eat. So, the other power sources we have... Is of course something we can check with the research tree. I could spec into natural gas generators if I decide to tame it, or the petroleum generator. However, I do not think that either of them is all that good, really. I personally tend to avoid them. And this bomb tend to be enough for, like, basic function of the entire base once I have enough duplicates. So at that point, I... I have one shine bug here, and now I do have access to solar panels. Two of them. I have yet to research glass tiles, so I'll have to do that, but I think we might be at the point where I could potentially make a spawn. No, not a spawn, a shine bug reactor. Also, this guy, we made him last time. So if I if I make a spawn no a shine bug reactor that's going to be it's going to be power for the base and it's also going to put less pressure on the spawn. So I might consider doing that. But for that I'll need to start shine bug uh, wrenching. Which of course will require... what is it? Phosphorite was it. Now, these guys make phosphorite, so that's not a huge issue. And they are stably producing eggs at the moment. I just need to reach the point where I could set up both a... What's it called again? Um, yeah, I need to set up, I need to reach a point where I have enough power for the incubator. Because I'll need at least one incubator in each of these rooms just so that if 
the amount of uh, Reckless starts to dip a little below what I should have. I can just have it turned on and start, uh, start incubating these eggs. So I should think of that and that of course ties back into the whole power situation so I don't need to sort that out. Hmm. I think, yeah, okay, let's actually let's check the principles. Okay, thimble reed and iron. Oh, iron could be real nice, but we could also think about having another duplicates. Both of these are vomiters. Super productive is. Nice overjoyed response, but I don't really know exactly what those do anyways. Uh, immune to the food po po poisoning is nice, though decreased strength is a little annoying. And practice artist is not really an issue. Uh, the gourmet though. Wait, food morale bonus. Uh, decreased food morale. So does that mean he's, oh, he demands more? He demands the food to be better. Well, that's that's issue. That's annoying. But increased cuisine. Does any of my duplicates really have? Oh, hang on. Does any of my duplicates really work with food? I mean, yeah, I set put score weird into it, but none of them. Okay, I don't think... What is up with these guys? Um, This guy can die because he is beyond... He is probably the one that laid the egg. Ugh. I don't like the fact that they are starting to hit the other critters. But yeah, um, none of those were too good. I'll take the iron. Should I just set up a... <laughs> okay. These guys... I'll have them working as just wild sources or sources of shellfish now that I... Some of them are starting to die up. But the other ones I don't really know, like... I want some to keep around so I don't lose them, but... There is already so many around the asteroid that I don't really think I need to keep either of them. And look, now they killed this poor little guy. Horrible. Well, um, can I get the meat? Also, the shellfish, is this set to pick it up? No. Please do that. The Priestess has also reached its minimum point, so that's working. And with the thermal sensor this close, it should also not be a problem. We should also not risk it suddenly reaching uh, the freezing point. Because if that were to happen, that would be real bad. <laughs> Buried object discovered. Oh yeah, it's oh it's a copper volcano. That, oh, that could be quite useful. Are these set to... no. Uh, enable harvest at a poor priority for everything like in the outer reaches here. Like it's not that important that we do it manually. Yes, they will drop it anyways. It is decayed. I don't know what it was to begin with, so it doesn't really matter. We can check here. Five plants for these uh, for this guy, the other two is slacking. No, don't think that's good. I'll have to do better. Now 
Okay, uh, none of these three areas are like good for farming, at least not sticking by the regular system I'm using. Uh, however, it appears it's possible. And same here. I mean, I can just like move the floors a little if I want to, but I'll try to stick within the regular system I'm using. The, I guess it's 6x12, or no, the 4x12 rooms, that's what I'll try to stick with. Also, uh, do build these. Now we're only missing rooms for the... Ah, let's... And then we can just... Uh, if we place a granite floor... And then we can just start creating a granite floor here as well. And finish a fourth and fifth room. Uh, once we you get more plastic. Oh. Let's check the report just to see. We've wasted 7.3 kilojoules. Manual generator of overproduction isn't a problem. The jumbo battery charge loss. I mean... Why am I even using jumbo batteries here? I really should just swap them out for regular batteries. Um, and uh... No wait, oh yeah that is supposed to be connected. Why didn't I design it like this? Uh, no, uh, at some point I'm going to have to upgrade the main power line. And since it's going to have to run... No. I mean, this actually... This could be good. If I just, like, now decide that this will be the end of, like, the living quarters, and that everything beyond here will be industrial, I can start making just a. I can just make a cool, cool room that has passive or active cooling, where I place a bunch of large power transformers running into different electrical networks around the base. Because, like, in total, the base system I have can take, like, can use a 6, 6k. At most, but on average, it's probably using about 500 when machines are working. Uh, oh, yeah, you're harvesting, that's okay. Down here, a strange place to grow an arbor tree. And actually, yeah, this one I I don't want you here. I want it to be safe for the dusk caps to grow down there, so... Hopefully the pips will find a better place for it. And yeah, now... Can we set these guys to, like... Only discharge? Um, I guess not reduce this. I guess we can start training into the desalinated. 
and like once this system runs out completely, which unfortunately it probably will, especially if I just set the high threshold to be, let's say, temporarily 9 or 15 percent, then it would barely produce energy. These guys will be drained to the point that I'm at least not losing much energy if I destroy them. Everything will be fine. Wait. Yeah, okay, this is correct. No. Bad, Soichiro. Bad. This is a one priority building. Go do something else. Once it falls below 1%. Now fuck off. Disable building. <laughs> Thanks. That's, that's how you gotta do it sometimes. Sometimes you just gotta tell the duplicates that no. You simply aren't allowed to work. Also let's just... Set it down to zero. This battery is not supposed to be charged, like, at all. We're running through all the charge in the jumbo batteries. Uh, you know what? Disconnect this and they'll be forced, because the jumbo batteries were unfortunately charging like ever so slightly whenever these guys were on. So now I'm just going to dump these into potential power, I guess you could call it. Before deconstructing them and picking up the power again. Now I can hook this back up to 15 and 90. And just let them run through the energy and hopefully it'll be fine. And people are idle. Uh, hmm. This one could potentially be used to plant stuff, this one can't, neither can this one. Hmm. Like, people want stuff to be done. Can I just look around to see if I find letters they can start picking up, I guess? Yep. And refrigerated letters. Why aren't you picking it up? And... Yep. More? Over here there's nothing. Neither down here it would seem, so that's it for letters. Okay. Uh, ugly Crier, Binge Eater, and Binge Eater. I don't think I want Binge Eaters, because... You know, if they do reach that point, then that's annoying. Decrease the core morale bonus, I don't think I want that. Although already plus 25 the core. Huh. Night time. You know what? Actually, that nails. Though can't do cooking or errands and. Nah. Uh, you know what? Nails. Yeah, you. I'll take you. You are the next person. Mm. 
Now you can also start excavating these areas so that you can actually build the bed. And that one extra colonist shouldn't damage score weird. I swear, what's your morale? You're living in luxury barracks? Yes, that's what it's called. Yeah. Um, you've got all this and still you're upset. I don't know, I know what's that, what that is about at this point. Oh yeah, yeah, I was actually supposed to like... Cut this cable now. Oh yeah, this way. Good. We have... Like a decent backlog of water now. So it shouldn't be fine. You can enable this building, I guess. Like if you guys are that desperate for something to do. This area has cooled down to the point it's usable, so... I should probably start moving a couple of guys in. Just to start populating the room. Alternatively, I could just, you know, move in an incubator. As I will be doing it later anyways. And then, I don't know where that'll get the eggs from though, that's a problem. <laughs> now in here, one, what is it? Two, uh, three, four. Four effective, no, five effective uh, sleep with plants, good. And what was it? One, two, three, four, five here as well. Five in this pocket, I believe. And was it just one here? Um, yeah, it was one like guaranteed good. The rest are like problems. Because oxygen and now polluted oxygen, so... Yeah, it may only be this one. And even that, that's on the verge of um, rotting, so that might only be one, actually. At which point it might be a good idea for me to just... No, I don't want to open up this one just yet. If I needed to dump a bunch of heat, I could do it, but I don't need to do that just yet. However, I need to start thinking about natural gas. That was also something I was intending to do this episode, or this stream. This episode. So, I guess I could start, like, designing it. So, this is where that part is. I'll need a I'll need a li liquid airlock. Natural gas is lighter than oxygen, but heavier than... Well, but heavier than most of the other things. Heavier than oxygen, lighter than the rest. That, that's the right goes. Um, More lettuces. Ah, oh, wait. We've got to set to do not disturb. Uh, now, I guess I can start designing the liquid airlock, so that will be a... I'll, I don't need to set in like tiles, but I'll do it just to make the design clear. Then I'll place... Yeah, 
is I need to dig these tiles and install a gas pump here. From here I'll export uh, it using igneous tiles. I'll run it through a gold amalgam cooling coil. I think I'll make it this large. Just checking. This is the top, so following the regular design, I'd have to place it along this line and I can hope. Following the regular lines will not be uh, a priority here. Or maybe I'll decide not to go above it at least. I guess that's the best I can do. And then, yeah. This. If this is the base design, we'll install uh, insulated tiles here, here, and on top. At some point we'll fill the room with hydrogen. I'll probably make just a opening at the bottom so that people can walk in. And once we fill the room, we'll just seal it off. Simple and effective. Then we'll also... Now this is where the difficult part comes in. I'll need Wii Sports for the design I'm intending to use. Three of them should be enough for a single uh, gas range. Of course, I will be setting up a system so that it will also act as a thermal battery at low temperature, so it should be an issue there. I will also start, you know, construction. 6 a.m. This is already cracked open, so it doesn't matter if I crack it open more. The moment I can stop construction here. Uh, yep, this. They can, they can do this. Alternatively, just to get like a slightly larger uh, cooling loop. I can just run it through the bottom and make it like this large. Probably a better way to do it. Then we hook it up and hook it up, remove the pots, put them back in, and at that point I need to look for Wii Sport. So, pinch a pepper nut has decayed, oh. I kind of wanted you to harvest pinch of pepper nuts here, but okay. Do, do what you want, whatever. Yeah. Whenever it says fleeing, I'm instantly like a little bit confused. As they aren't supposed to need to flee. this bad boy I want to have around here for a little while longer so maybe I should look for other sources of water weeds okay, I was hoping I'd get the warp seed here but no if 
I just say no, this isn't going to work and demolish this entire room. Or at least dig out the wee swords. Then that's a quick and easy... Oh, hang on. How is there a water wind here? Um, yeah. Howdy. Uh, if I... Yeah, probably should just crack this open. And grab all the stuff inside. Big ditch and... Hopefully we'll contain the polluted water. Then... Jump up around the cross, get the Wii Sport, and then I just need them to plant all this stuff. Uh, oh, uh, I also need this one just to ensure they don't lose anything. The gas pump can't be on be until I. Power. How is it working? Gas pump has to be up until natural gas has risen to the top and the chlorine has sunk. I have to do that to ensure. I guess it's not an immediate issue, but I'd like to keep the entire line filled with just natural gas so that it doesn't take any damage. Okay, I have to mine this tile as well. And... You know what? This plant is pretty much done so anyways. Grab the two top ones. Leave the last one. So it will leave it in here where it can also just grab the slit with grains that are not done. Although unfortunately most of them were. There's nothing here, so run in here and then to get the one down here I should I guess I can just install like a ladder here. First priority, just get everything. Pop there, drums, is it? Oh, yeah, it's uh, slightly too high pressure. And because it's cold, I've gotten hypothermia, that's that's fine, I can live with that. Excavate this, and same here. It's heat, why is it, you know, not too much, not too much is going in, so I can just seal it up quite promptly the moment I've get, go, got all the all I need. You know, actually, please grab the sweet wheat I want. Oh, I haven't set it to... Uh, this one can also take... sweet wheat. There we go. What 
also set this at 50%. Yep. Poor Weird is uh, having a bad time again, but that's... Hopefully that will change. <laughs> Something's here. It's a... It's a gay city. I mean, it's difficult to draw, but uh, you can clearly see that it's a gay city. So the question is just what it is. It, there's not really anything I need it to be right now, but it would be nice if it was a chlorine vent. I could use that. Hmm. With the polluted dirt removed, I guess it would be possible for carbon dioxide to start settling in, if I did this correctly. Uh, how much bottled carbon dioxide do I have actually? Nothing. I'm running around this deposit some carbon dioxide, but that's hardly enough. And the uh, temperature down here is a bit high. Although with this septum, if I could just make a... Uh, Metal block wall, then it would uh, leak small amounts of uh, heat in, and et voila, we would desiccate the rotten metals. Let's just take a quick look around and sweep some. Despite how long it takes for these plants to grow, we are getting a significant amount of lettuce. Probably due to the speed at which they grow. Oh. Lettuce. I mean, that is truly a theme here. Just lettuce. Yep, grab this one. Uh, carbon dioxide has settled in this pit, so... Okay, let's let's try to you know mop up all the stinky water, and with the system I have in place to use it, hopefully they'll bring it over, so that we can reduce the amount of stinky water in there. And here, yeah, temperature has already started to decrease ever so slightly. So now it's just time to... Oh. Indicate the layers here. And... Dig a tunnel in here. So that we can actually seal up this and then fill this area with hydrogen. Printable 
Tools and oh hell yeah, a ward seal, fantastic. Now we can also hmm. this plant. No, it's still a bit too much polluted oxygen in here, but. I mean, as long as the heat doesn't escape, I can just rework it into actually being functional, so it isn't too much of an issue just yet. Okay, good. Build the walls. Now, everything has just six priorities so that they make sure to do it. And nails can... Let's see. We don't have a doctor. Nails could be our first doctor. We have a rancher, but not a person that loves being a rancher, so... I guess not. Hmm. Having a doctor is probably useful. Here we have more fertilizer. Also a lot of chlorine gas. Hmm. Also, yeah, guess it's not necessary to turn this into a ladder, considering they can stand on it. Oh, blueprint. Oh, we get a... Choose Blueberry Drywall. Hmm. Let's see, those are under you. No, base. Ah, we got a couple of. Uh, got a couple of designs now. We got the Sun Worm, Snow Worm, Yellow Green, H2 and Lava Wave, Magma Wave, and Blueberry. Wait, is it polluted oxygen in there? Oh yeah. Hmm. Okay, that's one thing that I've seen the duplicates do a couple of times that I find confused by. They run up to like a number of items that they're supposed to dump resources into. They just like kind of poof on them and then they run off. Why would they do that? Mm, neural Vaculator. I do want that one, but I... Mm -hmm. Which one of my duplicates should I give it to though? Also that's... Like now I've just been giving all of the polluted dirt or storing all the polluted dirt here in anticipation of feeding it to the sun shell at some point, but maybe I shouldn't. Because uh, polluted dirt can be turned into regular dirt. I can use the regular dirt to uh, make, yeah, use the regular dirt to feed the mealwoods. Mirwood feed Draco, Draco feeds the um, colony. So, one thing uh, I kinda could consider doing is just letting a pip 
into like a cold zone of natural blocks to just grow wheat wheat because that is one of the plants that I will need large amounts of and the moment I am in now I don't think I can I don't think I can support my colony on like just wild uh what is it called again? Wild sleet bits. I think I'll have to domesticate them at some point. And uh, I disconnect this so the system is closed. Ipsy dipsy. Oh. Um. Okay, so even though there's a carbon dioxide pit, it's not high enough pressure, carbon dioxide. Oh, well. Uh, how did you get hurt, actually? Like, I've seen a couple of these guys being hurt, but... Surely the sand shells can't reach them on this ladder. Right? That would be silly. That wouldn't make sense. And that would be also annoying. Oh yeah, actually... I need to remember this. With the design I'm going for, I'm, I'm of course going to need to know the temperature of the contained gas. So I'm going to have to set up a gas thermal sensor and connect it up. Then I'm going to need to run a power wire, which I barely can afford around well it's uh hmm I guess it's down into this start to deconstructing all of the automation wire maybe maybe you won't have to mine land Actually, I completely forgot to check the uh, buried, buried areas, but I don't want too many. So it shouldn't be an issue. Or at some point I might return to those anyways with proper ceiling. Close the surroundings. It's not a problem if they're just standing in the gas, but once they enter the water it becomes a little too hot for them. Which I completely understand. 68 degrees? I... I'd die. I wouldn't survive those conditions. I'll just... Let that be. Maybe. But here, yeah, the construction is going okay here. And since it's copper, I think I can just splurt. Are you okay? Now, yeah, there you go. Ah, oh, wait, ah. Oh. I mean, hopefully I won't have to re-enter the 
natural gas area anyways, but I, this might be a problem since I need to place another bag. Maybe I don't need to type. Maybe should. I also need to place this so that they can actually make it in. Even when I blocked up the waste port. I can just cut the power line so that it doesn't actually uh, start pumping when it's done. Wait, where's all this chlorine coming from? I probably... Probably... But no, but that would just push it up here. Shouldn't be moving over here. And stone hatchlings. Hmm. Uh, actually, the stone hatchlings are interesting as they are the precursor to the smooth hatch. But my question is yeah, they can refine. Minerals with a 75% efficiency compared to the rock crusher, which only has 50%, and the uh, refinery that that has 100%. Okay, so this is first crude oil dump to be the bottom layer, then I will fill it up with, uh, let's say, water. Yep, there's the crude oil delivery and another blueprint. I think there's like a... Oh! It's only a cot, but still that's, that's a little more fancy. Uh, yep. No, actually salt water. That's a little higher freezing point, even though shouldn't reach it. It's still nice to have it just in case. Pinch of pepper, ah no. I keep forgetting about it. Mm. Just looking around for lettuce again. have some pretty fresh as well. Uh, sleet wheat should harvest it. Seems about uh, that. Down here they... Look at these. These two, two guys aren't that effective at all. Three plants, this guy has planted five. Get on it. We need lettuce. <laughs> now the bomb lilies are starting to die. A pepper nut. Oh yeah, this can be a no fill. Just 
Just increase the priority of every remaining thing to 6. So that they hopefully do it soon. Oh no, it's the cement. But you sent it in one message. Uh, is everything okay with you? My man didn't use two messages. He must be dying. Well. Rid the pump so that we can get the remaining water. Two here, so that's down here and two here. Making it two. And such. Just set up a gas dispenser here. Can this, uh, that would mean removing this ladder. So make sure that I uh, just complete the building of everything here. Wait, is it too hot here? Yeah, I guess 40 degrees is a little toasty. And then set it so that nothing below or nothing above zero degrees is allowed through. Actually, 15. Cooling down my base is the intention, so I don't need to make it too cool, too cold. And then just start installing the transport lines. Transport it through the roof. This can work. Now we just need to... Actually, no. For the time being, it can just be constructed here. Try to not cause any unnecessary damage to the natural cave formations. Let's see how these guys are doing. Yep. They're getting close to hatch and drown. What a lovely life. And just, yeah, they are not allowed to eat anything tasty. They are only allowed to eat Lice loaf. That is the punishment they have. Okay, leveled up again. Though the fact that I am not feeding them does mean that they're Becoming a little bit upset from time to time. Mm. 
but uh, let's check the oh, power. Power wasted is just from manual generated overproduction for the most part. Most power usage to the gas pumps. Then electrolyzers, micro machine, yada yada. And how is Soichiro managing to consume a total of 30 kilograms when I've only consumed 10? Wait a minute. Uh, why? So what is this again? 100 grams. Oh yeah! I have... was it the diver's lung? A deep diver's lung, so it's only 50. That's the reason. Also seal. Yes. Now, uh, we're with the natural gas system planned. We also need to. It needs to be hooked up to the rest of the power system, which will be expensive. Ooh. Snazzy red suit. Although I could have. Let's see here. Uh, Lice loaf hasn't gone down, so I think we can afford another duplicate. Hmm. Increased medicine, we already had that. Super hard digging. Air consumption rate. I mean, that's not an, a huge issue, but still. I think uh, he's also being cheated, which I don't want. Ratchet. Uh, animal lo lover? Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Maybe we'll take me. May can probably do a great job here. Now we'll just have to set the priorities. Um, let's see here. Decorating. New duplicates are not allowed to decorate. Well, actually, none of these guys are allowed to decorate. Because once we get someone who can, de who knows how to decorate, they'll. Do all the decoration. Okay. This proved the flaw in the design. So it's good that I started to do this so that I can see it. What's up with you? Wait. Oh yeah, you were flatulent. I guess that means I'm going to have just a slight natural gas production constantly. Hmm. Not, uh, not an issue, actually. Because... Can you... how often and how much is the question then? That doesn't tell me. If it's... if it had been like a consistent amount, maybe it could be enough to power the gas range, you know? But unfortunately it probably isn't. Uh, do I have access to that much uh, 
it's leaf weight? Yeah. I mean, in that case, just always create rock spans. Um, I just need to make sure that once they create frost buns that they never eat it. This is not the place where people are allowed to eat stuff. They will starve. Oh, why are you so happy? <laughs> I'll just create a prosper tomorrow as quickly as possible so that I can say that you're not allowed to eat it before dinner time and then finish the construction. We are starting to fill up on small amounts of excess oxygen, which is nice, you know. Important to have for later. Oh, whoa. where are you going with this? Immediately delivering like that? Oh, no. Hush. <laughs> Now I might not be able to deliver it. Now this is where you're supposed to deliver the hydrogen. So, uh... Is the hydrogen still here? No. They managed to deliver it. Okay, that will allow this room to cool down. Just sweep everything in here to avoid the mess. Why are you... Ugh, these guys. They're hurting themselves due to the hot oil. If only they knew how to take care of themselves. You, no. No. What? No. <laughs> you are not supposed to take these materials, okay? Ah, oh, jeez. The slime and the oxalite goes in the waterlogged one. You avoid the muting into the atmosphere. Releasing. Alright, so hopefully uh, everything will fall out and there will be like a small pocket of hydrogen at the top here. And at that point, we can seal it off. you say. Well, in that case, please remove this oxyphan. And you know what? Uh, maybe deliver it here, I don't know. Just make sure it's not in this uh, pit anymore.
Nils, what happened to you? Okay. Now we can just say, nope, you're not slowing back anymore, but it's out of the way. Okay, good. I think we can just seal up this now. There's no hydrogen in the room and it's starting to slowly leak out. And then we just need to um, finish this conductive wire, right? You have the lead, right? I don't know, maybe you don't. I'm sorry guys, but you got to dig more lead. And this is probably why they hurt, hurt. Because they keep diving into the lead. Yep. Yeah. Because it's scolding down there. Also make sure to actually pick up the frost buns here. Rip JC, he hurt in the flames. Yep. <laughs> okay, that that's just some um, that's not cool, man. You didn't have to oh sh you fuckers. Oh man. I guess that's that sticks sir. <laughs> Didn't last long. Yep. So this room is starting to cool down. Uh, this power line's done, so you can open this one. And just wait, I guess. Crack it open, and then we need to finish the lead power wires. And that did not take all the lead, luckily. We can afford <laughs> some more power wires. And a new printable. I don't think we'll go for another duplicate just yet. Oh, then they... Catalina be like worst duplicate ever. Nah, we're, t we're taking this NASA suit. I give that to me. And... Other than that, just finish the construction. Now with this we should be producing a decent excess power. Hopefully. If so, we could maybe think about uh, hooking up the two electrical grids. Oh, scolding. Jeez, uh, you, you're not supposed to stand down there. Please, Nails. Nail, Nail. Oh, sh um. I hope this doesn't kill her. Uh, can somebody save... Nails, please. I have a trudge cut, yeah. Okay, you assholes, actually save... <laughs> please save Nails, someone. Guys! 
Okay, this is not quite save nails, please. Ah, no, uh, nails died. Uh, oh wait, nails was our doc doctor. Uh, a moment of silence in the memory of nails. Why? Right, uh, now I need to find a place to start uh, burying my duplicates. I didn't think I'd reach uh, this point so quickly. Honestly, didn't think I'd be killing off my duplicates. Now people are going to get stressed since they're mourning. A person has died. Nope, I can't place it there because, you know, the poker shell did deserve better than to be placed with nails. Place uh, the... <laughs> I'm sure nails would be thrilled to know she's been buried alongside the power, the power generation. Now, um, died of suffocation. Total skill points, two. Great. <laughs> uh, well, with uh, that happening... Yeah, I should... I need to crack open the... I need to just make a hole here so that the oil can hopefully leak out so that they don't have to wade through large amounts of it because that's definitely what killed them. The fact that they got heat stroke, they got slower and slower the more hurt they got and uh, then they couldn't escape in time and no one, no one came to rescue them. Oh well. Also, I'm going to disable auto-harvest on these trees. I don't need to do this, just don't stand there, you're going to die. Nine priority. We have no one to use them, because we lost nails. Yeah, ah, this is going to be a wonderful final resting place. Rest in peace, Nails. Why did you do this to us? Reduces health hazards. Wait. Is the corpse full of germs? I I don't get what uh, the burial has to do with health hazards. Like, hang on. JC is more is more of a health health hazard than nails. Like what? Also, I need to. Hmm. I should have a sharing station in here, but there's no room. Hmm. How do I fix that? Yeah, the polluted oxygen is at the top, I guess that's... That is what it is. It will be removed and it Sure, it will damage the thing imaging, but still, we just need this system done so that we can start making cross burgers. 
No. Oh my. Mm. This is some fucked up. Fuck. Get the shit fucking done. Make like sure, luckily it was only at the bottom. The top is still in freezing temperatures, but still. Why did this have to happen? Okay, wait, is it cool? No, it's... Oh, fuck. Excuse me, thermal sensor. Is that what you think you are? You are actually below the freezing temperature. My... Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Okay. We're we're fine. I I think we're fine. We we just lost some pinch of pepper nuts. Stop it, please. Okay, but that just proves that everything needs to be hooked up to these bridges. Get to work, everyone. Good. Below 30. Um. How am I going to do this? Uh. Let's hope that the small amount of crude oil is not going to be too much. Okay, good. Now deconstruct it immediately. And rebuild it, destroy this. It's anyways just a duplicate. <laughs> well, this uh, was an unexpected twist that I... Oopsie daisy. Uh, please finish this so that Soichiro doesn't die. think my colony can handle another death. Okay, this is 10 degrees, even though this is negative 40. Why is it negative 40? Okay, tell me, how is this only negative 30? Crude oil. Um, do I have like a small, but that I re mean really small packet of uh, crude oil somewhere? Jeez, this is... Oh, this is annoying, please. You know, this system... This system was doomed to fail, wasn't it? 
The sensor is too far away, there's not enough thermal coupling. Here we see it's uh, already filling up with liquid chlorium. The only redeeming factor is that it hasn't broken down just yet. You know, take this, I just dump this oil. I, I can't be bothered right now. Enjoy your seeds. No more. Too much. Fuck that, too much. Oh boy, oh boy. Take this immediately. Now. Ugh. Let's see here. Immediately just take this and dump it here. Like for this box, it's... It is a problem. This is... Okay, good. This top wall is done. But since clearly this shitty system does not work properly, I'm going to have to set up an automation wire here. Like, give both of them the same settings and hopefully this will fix itself. Oh, jeez. And by, and I mean now, get it done. I don't have time for this shit, JC. Get back to work, please. Please just deliver it. Okay, good. Copy settings there. If below. Um, close the top quickly. And I mean quickly. And deconstruct these tiles. I don't care if you're starving, we don't have time for food. This one being right next to should hopefully like just immediately switch. And now I just sweep up the crude oil. Maybe I'm going to have to make a separate system so that excess, when it reaches below 40, it like closes the door somewhere else so that we don't risk this happening again. Again, crude oil. This is 800 grams, so that's probably going to be too much. Um. And this is, actually this is 118, perfect. Great. Now deconstruct it. And... Start draining the system. Ah, 
Ah, wait. Oh, piss. If I'm going to reinsert hydrogen into this system, I'm going to have to make a gas pocket and a gas pump, aren't I? Great. Um, you know what? I'll make the gas pocket. Gas pocket here. And connect it up with a pipe. Just make sure it's not immediately on. And just to make sure there's enough, build a canister empty. And food does decay. Uh, doesn't really matter, but we can sweep the rest. This truly is a lettuce sweep. Yeah, nothing over here. Might be... No, nothing here. No, no. No, nothing more I can see. Uh, this system... Oh, you fuck! When does... Okay, so that's... Uh, why? No. Uh... If it is above... Negative a hundred, you keep the door open. Hang on. It pushed the crude oil back into place. I think. Okay, good. Um. Now just, um, we hope. But nothing fucks up. Oh, stop, please! What the fuck is... Wait, what? Where did the crew door go? Um, you know what the f ah, I think I know why this was an issue to begin with. It's because I decided to use crude oil. What an idiot I was. Okay. I have enough Nullazilla. Let's fix the mesh, the mess I made. Uh, here, excellent place. And just fucking dump it into this small tile. Everything here, nine priority. Because you're going to build this. Oh wait, I can't just place it there. I have to place it here, don't I? Uh, And the pitcher can fit there, the liquid went there, everything just need a small amount of, eth of ethanol so that I can fix the hole here. No point in draining it, so just close the door I guess for now. 
everything is hopefully cold enough. Work faster, please. Situation has gone about so fast. Hmm. Okay, next day I'm making this a yellow alert priority. I simply have no patience anymore. Everyone's going to sleep, yes. Ah, oh, look at this. Oh yeah, Nails had this bed. Well, Nails not Nails isn't with us anymore, so... All of this is to be finished tomorrow. We do not have time to wait. I think I realized one of the problems they are running to the copper vein. Oh, Dracut, that's nice. Stop condensing chlorine, please. Okay, good. Now, high priority, make some fucking ethanol. Okay, let's uh, cut it at the source. Now you're going to place some ethanol there. Infinite priority. Don't, no, don't destroy it anymore. Sorry. Uh, Grab a small piece of ethanol, put it there. Okay, um... Chlorine evaporates... Oh, jeez. I can't just flush it through either, because... That would be problematic. To the temperature it's at. Ah, oh, it's ah, oh, it's not enough, so it doesn't recognize it. I see. There, you're not getting any more. Okay, I have... Then, stop ethanol. And, you know what? Crack this open. Now, mop that tile. That should hopefully fix this. So that's a do it now order. Hmm. I don't dare like shut this off until it's actually done. I'm so worried for my food now. This is a terrible situation I got myself into. But at least I have ethanol now, and 
Luckily, Apenol only freezes at 114 degrees. So, I'm pretty much good there. I just don't want to change the Druid Oil one because I'm afraid. Okay, wait. Okay, it's reached uh, the point where it's uh, no longer a problem. So now I should hopefully be able to safe now uh, safely seal it up and start training. Okay, now it's set it below negative 30, which it is. Don't you fucking dare start condensing again. Hey, you know what? Do it like this. Seal this just for a moment. And then make sure that I actually pump it in the right way. Yeah. Good. Now it's going to force... Let's see. Gas selective. It's going to force hydrogen to the top. And the hydrogen is cold enough. Now I just need to force out the chlorine. Hopefully it will drain faster than the hydrogen. Don't, don't, there you go. Now, just pick this up again and immediately cut it. And we should have enough hydrogen. Okay. Um. See, this one fluctuating is dangerous, so it's good that we have to set it up like this now. Okay. Ah, uh, that's done. Now we can actually get back to you know everything else we were trying to get done. We have an ethanol distiller, but I, I'll probably just delete it quite quickly. Uh, um, yeah. Can I like just say that you are assigned to the triage cot so that you can start healing, maybe? What are you doing there? No, I. I need to start flushing out the uh, carbon dioxide. Uh, you know what? Pip, ah, uh, the pip can't cross it because of the gap. You know what? Um, place a new storage bin here and just set it to contain the oxyphones. Hopefully it'll plant it up here. But, you know, these guys saw them do what we want them to, so we'll see. Did you grab this? No, just dug it up. Didn't grab it just yet. That's okay. Here it comes. <laughs> Ow. Oh. <laughs> Trying to heal in a room filled with chlorine gas. That's... Uh, that doesn't sound good. 
And also now that I've actually increased the amount of uh, duplicates I have, I've also increased the amount of... Uh, what is it called again? Um, the amount of carbon dioxide I'm producing, so... The situation isn't going to change exactly. And score where this upset again. But then again, what's new? Oh, sh uh, you're not set to take cooked seafood? Oh, no. What's yellow alert? I have this guy. I guess you can deconstruct it. Just make sure to finish this tile so that you can actually eat. And that's it. Oh, new blueprint. Basic green pants? Okay. Oh. The system is starting to cool. We've uh, emptied it for our. We've removed all the foreign elements. However, these said foreign elements are on their way to the gas range. I mean, one way to fix it is to just. Uh, Seal the foreign elements and just start emptying the pipe. And this gas can now start cooling itself a little more. Now, with these pipes, we'll get some slow cooling of the base. And we'll also be able to start uh, making frost burgers. This is what we've been waiting for. Even though when I start making frost burgers I don't know if I'm going to let them eat it, like, just yet. You know, I am a cruel master. I make them eat, make food, but I don't let them eat it. What the? What did you draw? Hmm. some meat, we have a bunch of barbecue. Lysloaf hasn't really gone down since we got the new... I mean, we only got one new guy technically since we lost the other one, so... Yeah, I don't know. Don't know. Right, back to uh, power. I am now, like I'm going to make a more, a better system later on, but for now I'm just going to install it as a regular cable. And then we'll see if the system is able to support our base. Like, uh, of course there are certain parts that are, though on the power line I don't use much and there are some that just even though they have a high voltage they don't actually drain energy you know <laughs> what the f are you okay me 
Okay, I know you're not not allowed to eat much, but you didn't have to eat meal lights like that. Guess, guess they were hungry. Oh, he drowning. What a sad existence it is to be a Dracula baby in this uh, civilization, or in this society. He has seconds left to live. No, don't meant to didn't mean to do that. Like now I'm just delivering everything straight to the fridge that I could deliver at least meat and such. To the kitchen when I when I build the kitchen. I do hope that these guys create a gold fry at some point so that they can start cleaning up this piss pool. Was that suffocation or scolding? Probably scolding. Food has decayed. Oh. Food decays all the time. And it's not fun, but it's just the way things are. Because I'm producing lettuce everywhere, but it's not being harvested automatically. It's so now speaking of a. Uh, How's, our, how's things going here? They're exactly the same. You have so many water weed seeds and you don't want to plant them? Shame on you guys. Oh, I thought uh, these guys would uh, work for me, but no. They're lazy. Maybe I should read up on how to get those guys to plant everywhere. <laughs> Cooked seafood. Oh yeah, no, most of it was rotting, wasn't it? There are so many people with skill points that I won't be using for a little while. And this area is sl just slowly creating a... Slowly creating a cold area. So which will slowly but surely cool down the rest of the base. Assuming uh, at least not too high Natural gas consumption. Okay. Let's just uh, mop these areas to hopefully make it a little less hot. Make them not stand in the hot areas too much. Yep, going straight for the dig, that's your job. I am sorry. You didn't. Oh, okay. Yeah, uh. I guess. Yes. Now we're not doing stuff. Oh. 
I'm just we'll just fill in the bolts and leather as we keep going forward. And now we I did oh yeah. El Mr. Polka Shell. He got stuck. Probably deserved, to be honest. And again, reached a near death scenario. Please plant something, Pip. You know you want to. You know you don't need the meal woods here. Oh. And it only needs negative 34. Good. That means the system is somewhat working better. And oops, uh, not this one. Ventilation. More or less, the system seems to be doing fine. Probably due to the fact that the manual generator is used every so often. Which does slowly charge the rest of the system. I don't know. Something like that. And it's time to install a printer sensor. As well as power lines. I am sorry, but it's back down into the oil pit. <laughs> ah. These guys have their work cut out for them. That's for certain. Hmm. Oh, I yes, say both of them were planted now. Good, now we're making some. Oxygen and show bowls. A nice sort of source of meat. Now, okay. I want to explore more of the asteroid, but uh, most of the places where exploration is necessary now is around these ugly ass swamps, which I don't really want to dig into. So I'm going to have to dig around. So let's look around if there's an area I would like to look into. See. Change it to granite. straight up in order to see what's up there, I guess. This is one of the areas where there are, where there is oxygen. We should probably exploit that as much as possible. Because it will be annoying if they have to, like, run far back for every breath of oxygen. So hopefully we can avoid. And 
checking back still plenty of hydrogen okay we with the usage of the manual generator we might be at the point where it's doing well just need to start uh, looking into fixing up some other stuff also I, I got a peel for this poor dust cap it's it needs carbon dioxide to survive but it's in between two oxygens that slip up, slip up all of it and make oxygen and those two have uh, reduced a total of eight kilograms of oxygen this cycle which is frankly pitiful amounts also we've used far more oxygen than we've produced yet again it's just the way things are and i don't like it but maybe I don't know whether like wild bit ranching is a producing good at all. Also the sun shell dies. Let us not create more food than we're actually going to use. Like sun shell they create shellfish. I make seafood, so I can make surf and turf. But I don't want to make surf and turf because I want to make frost burgers. And both of them take barbecue. And since frost burgers are better and I have a stable source of lettuce, there's no point in making surf and turf. So then I don't need seafood. And once I start making frost burgers, they're obviously not going to want to eat cooked seafood. So there's not really a point in farming those. And if the amount of critters in the world is deci decisive for the amount of lag, I don't want to have many. So I'm going to need to be careful about that. Now. Maybe it's time to... Set up a little... Theodorizer in here. Because I think it may be time to explore this little area and... Start using these magnificent reed fibers. And beyond that, I can check how, how things up. Oh, they barely started. I guess that was to be expected. So, I'll, I mean, it's fine if they just focus on what's in the base. Now, um, maybe I should think about uh, just sealing off the front here so that not so much um, heat enters or, yeah, so that not too much heat enters this place. This box is not supposed to contain meat or omelette. How much lice load do I have? Or lice? Hmm, a bit. A bit more than I need. But 
the deer. This guy is stuck down here. I don't want to learn to focus on taking down due to how dangerous it is. Don't want them to harvest this tree really. So it's just ah do stuff. And uh, you know, deliver stuff to this gas range if you can. Instead of just <laughs> dumping it back into the system, maybe. Yep, no, well, if you don't want to listen, that's fine. In the meantime, it's... What are you doing? Hey. Please. <laughs> When I set it to be one priority, it was kind of like, uh, one, they won't do it. But if you're that... Also, May, you're not too fast. Maybe you shouldn't go down there. You're going to need to work some more on the treadmill first. Just create a shot down here and start walking. Start, you know, gathering pinch of pep plants and such. Start exploring more. Let me see what this throughout the map. Let me find the way to the ancient specimen. That is where we want to go. Oh, it's dripping over. Great. Um. Oh yeah. Was something here, right? I I need to explore what that was. Huh. Exactly me. Run that treadmill and actually get quick for once. While I stash away this omelette that you guys are not allowed to eat. So, you're old enough, I can wrangle you. Um, oh yeah, you're still hurt. Now, Open this door. It's time we see what was inside. A computer desk with a document. Oh, never mind. A neural vacillator. Let's give this one to JC. And let's hope for something good. He got the deep diver slung as well. Finally. Now he won't be as much of a waste of oxygen. <laughs> and we can all and now that we have access to the reed fiber, we can see what we want to do with it. I... 
the room size is 87, it's honestly a little too small. What to do? Also can I just like make the make the Frost Burger soon? Like how much? You still have a ton of sleep to though. Okay, I get, I get it. You're not. No, you aren't eating the crossbow. Good. Can't have any of that. Can't let you guys eat important stuff. It's all food for the grinder. Make this a its priority and... I don't know, start picking up everything in here. Maybe you should go and get better. You don't have to take care of everything. Let other people do some work as well. Wait, I didn't know me was a doctor. Or is that, or is she just the best alternative? Uh, maybe, maybe me is a doctor. Quite possible. Hmm. Okay, and just copy settings so that we don't waste um, eggs. <laughs> Lettuce is by far our most uh, available food source. Interesting. And unfortunately, you guys haven't done anything else, have you? No. That's disappointing, honestly. I'm going to find a way to break you guys so that you'll actually do what you're supposed to do. I see. Uh, K 
Okay, so the most effective I can get these pips to be is for them to plant every other tile. Although, I, I don't get why this guy won't plant. Good, see. Now, please do your job. No, nope. I won't. Ah, well, uh. Cutlet Prince Egg. Haven't made any Frostburgers yet. Too busy making Lice Loaf. Which, to be fair, is important since that's almost it. Wait. Ah, uh, where is it? Uh, stress. Did you. She seemed to comment on the flatulence. So the duplicates does notice. Ah. Uh, wait, what was the. Every five tiles vertically. Um, I'm going to wait for these plants to reach the point where that where they. All, all are able to be harvested, and then I will try to uh, game the system to get the farm to be more better. to the sea biome here. If we just finish up the tunnel like this, will they be able to see the entire game? Okay? Yep, though digging might take some time since they need to breathe. Maybe I'll take another duplicate. See, germ resistance, grease monkey, banshee. Oh. But I now oh, the increase the creativity. That's not good. I need. I need a creative dupe actually. And it seems like Amari is just what I need them. But I will not allow Amari to do any art until he's a pro at it. Well, we are seeing more and more. But nothing special just yet. Just sedimentary rock, nothing special. And more salt and such. 
Oops. We had the salt water leak. Yeah, this isn't a scenario where I would necessarily mind digging the abyss light. As I don't really want as it or they would just stabilize until like 38 degrees maybe. Which it would be an issue. And this tricklet guy over here, uh, you are being detained and brought to your new home. Oh, fresh let now, not fresh. Good. Amari, Amari, if you're not able to move quickly maybe you shouldn't go down there can i just like set um every new bit to be like mm, oops nothing but uh operating so that so so that they, instead of doing, you know, dangerous stuff like walking around, they just run on a treadmill every day. Ah. What is it? Hotkeys L. Good. Uh, maybe I should make more manual generators, like, so that they can actually do that then. And another uh, trick that has been born into pain. Okay, uh, this those four requires two more before they'll start stealing the eggs. Now whether or not the old guy will actually be able to lay an egg in time is... That's another question actually. Because they have a base reproduction rate of what... Um, base reproduction of 1. So that's... 105 years when they already have their first, their first child and then every 10 cycles. I actually might be able to have another child in time. Make and research astronomy. What was May supposed to do actually? I don't really remember, so I just said, nah, do astronomy, do this, do that. Now it's um, 60, negative 60 degrees and these plants will stop working. Shame. And we, oh, oh. Well, luckily this fine gentleman of a slickster has uh, saved us from this dangerous orchid. What the? F okay, why are there so many geysers? This is stupid. Give me more vents. Also, oh, oh, fuck, there's, there's a leak. Um, what are, you, what are you doing here? Uh, don't know what to do about the leak. So let's just ignore it and hope it fixes itself over time. Like how many cycles till these are done? 
48, so that's 4.8 is 10%. 16%, that's about uh, 7 cycles. Yes. I don't know if I said the right words, but I think the conclusion I reached is correct. Now, uh, just finish building this shaft. Because there is something up here, and I want to know what. There's water, there is oxygen, there is more copper. But what more is there? And then... Where to? I need to find where I'm supposed to send these guys. Uh, you know what? Uh, let's just... This is a floor. So let's start uh, um, mining at least up until this point. And install ladders where needed. So that we don't ruin perfectly good farmland. Once we reach this point, I guess it's possible to just go slightly underground for the rest. Yep. A small pocket of water, there's no, no cool steam vent ruining stuff. Wait. Yeah, no. Hang on, I, have I been seeing... Yeah, I've been saying stuff wrong and marking stuff wrong, haven't I? Every, like, event, the events of the stuff I don't really want too many of. The geysers are the things I want. Right, because this is a uh, saltwater geyser. So is that thing up there? So these guys to be seven. And priorities may and Amari can focus on that because I think operating means running the treadmill. Amari, what are you doing? I guess I haven't denied you to do it, but said I I don't want you to do it. Okay, so there's so little to do around the base that the people that are be that are being told do absolutely nothing actually are doing anything, are doing stuff. They are not listening. Um, I know I have six six duplicates is enough at this point. Okay. 
good. Now we're starting to charge the system. Let's just do this so that they can actually move a little bit if they want to. Too many eggs just yet. Set this to granite so they don't actually have to move resources too far. Oh, six priority, sorry. And uh, the dioxide pocket. Give me something nice. Give me something uh, worthy of my YouTube shorts. Oh no! Um, dig this tile just to let the little boy out, but uh. Okay, please. Please save little bro. No one cares. Oh, and the schedule, I, I kind of forgotten about this. Let's move JC over to the other schedule. And now they're going to drop it. Yeah. Maybe I should set up like a system that uh, forces, like has have it like, like a small section of the base where people are forced to run the treadmills for the first part of their <laughs> living. Like, oh, you welcome to the colony, now you have to run for 17 cycles. By restricting where they're able to go. Hmm? Another large pool of salt water. I'm really going to have to find a way to, like, use this. I need to use the salt water. Oh wait, it's actually slowly growing, even though it's in the wrong atmosphere. That's good, good to hear. And um, yeah, uh, this fridge. Just if I want to stop the heat leakage, the heat leakage, I need to my heat rises. So I guess we want to make a dent. And with the system here, uh, what is the purpose of this auto sweeper again? Auto sweeper again. Maybe I should just press this conveyor load there. It's sweep only, so. Build this and set up a actually set it up like this just to avoid trouble and check that they haven't made no they have not made any frost burgers yet. Okay, 
Okay, this is the end of the, uh, the other side. Just see as long as the eye can see. But where is the... I don't know, the dirt. Because there are some... There is like a foresty biome, but I haven't encountered this... Can't encounter it yet here. Is that one of the biomes that are unable to spawn on this asteroid? This poor poker shell will die alone down here. Maybe it's what it deserves. Three hundred degrees. That's a bit too hot for my liking. I guess I want this to be relatively high up, just for ease of access. And then if you guys would prioritize it so that I could move the filters over and just delete the other one so that I can finish the ball. We need to get it uh, done properly and let's uh, let's research glass blowing. It's been a while since we did any research. Beyond that, uh, what more do I need? But to explore. This one's going to take some time. And uh, beyond that, it's just around and up or around and down most areas. So the question doth become what is the simplest way to do it? Also, what? I think this is one of the... Why? What causes this? Because it's probably like salt water pushes in due to the pressure, but hydrogen and carbon dioxide can't compress anymore, so it pushes back. The salt water that did push in falls down. And then it just loops around, so that's probably what happens, but the fact that it generates like that, that's that's kind of cool, actually. Uh, I need to find a way to ensure that uh, I can keep that for later. Like in a muse museum, perhaps. But then again, there's a couple places I've talked about making stuff making stuff like here I need to research glass so that I can uh, try to encase this thing in glass without losing any of the contents that's also an important step Lettuce is the lettuce is rotting because I am not paying attention. So just sweep over everything and find the remaining lettuce. Find all of it. Now, now 
Okay, that's that's essentially erupted all the way through already. No point in harvesting that. And uh, 94 and 95. Okay, these guys are soon ready to harvest. And then I will be able to start planning there. Planning these seeds properly. Because I did look it up and apparently these pips plant things in groups of threes or in singular groups. And the groups of three are have to be distanced three or have to have three empty tiles between each group. The singular groups only need one. And yep, that was the route. And what you can do is uh, if you plan the farm out so that you well cover most of it in like just one priority ladders then you can get them to plant on the areas where you haven't planned anything then remove the next one get them to plant there and then so on and so forth and you have to work was it right to left top to bottom when you plant these things to get them to plant most efficiently oh i'll just double check that uh. Okay, no. Top top to bottom and then left to... No, right to left. So each, you take each... Uh, with each row or each column? No. It, it's, it's each row, yeah. That's a weird way of writing it. Okay, that's glass blowing down. Do I need to... I need... Renaissance art is going to be nice. Just for later use. Once I'm able to do the quorum, I'm definitely going to want to do the quorum. Right there. Uh, Two cycles left until uh, seven cycles has passed, so at that point we'll see whether or not I was right about my prediction. And honestly, it seems like I was pretty much right. But maybe a little off. They only need one more before the eggs are going straight into the drowning chamber. Or well, before most will go into the drowning chamber, I will intend to still keep the incubator running. And here they have coal. Which means they got something to eat, which they weren't supposed to. Not good. I need to um, execute one to show who is in charge. And of course I'll execute the oldest ones. Because they are probably the wisest. Rest in peace, Nails. This is where she always wanted to be buried. In a place that we're going to seal off soon. Now... Uh... Wait, they're keeping on digging down slowly? Damn. Didn't intend for them to do that. Hey, yo, who's... I... 
we just went that far before starting the combat. Death. What meat? You still haven't... Okay, you know what? Seven priority. Just... Just make the Frostburgers main. I want to... I want to deny you the ability to eat them. And also, I, sh I haven't built enough tables. That's fine art. Let's see here. Yep. And wow, hey, hey. If you place down the construction fast enough, they will overlap. So that you can have not one or not one. You can have many canvases. But then again, why would you? Because the max decor is obviously 120, which that's what the game says, but uh, the duplicates can... Uh, well... Uh, the decor system is strange, because even though it says like, oh, max decor is 120, when you reach it in an area, it still seems like the duplicates can see the core way above it which is you know stupid that it, that's how it works but still because there's like there's no limit to how bad the decor can be just how good where is because just for an example what's my worst tile Okay, it would seem that my worst tile isn't all that bad, but still. Under than set up oh, there we had it. 162 it was at when these guys weren't here. That's real bad, yeah? Even worse. The core can be really bad, but for some reason they they won't allow it to be amazing. Which is a silly thing to do. Was it scolding or suffocating? I might stop going down there. You... Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to have to build a... Pneumatic door here. Just to keep like the... Uh, but it doesn't matter. I can't build it there. I need to find a way to keep the new duplicates within grounds, because otherwise they'll just go somewhere where they're unable to believe, and then barely be able to leave in time. Okay, high culture, that's the landscape canvas and the metal block. Okay. Oops. Ah. There we go. Then just move this. I'm just, I'm using this threat because I want to have quite good rooms here. So I've had two overlapping landscape paintings. Uh, they should give pretty decent decorum, especially once they've been painted actually. And uh, like at some point I might build metal blocks in the rooms but I don't I can't afford to do it yet so for now it will just be simple 
large sculpting blocks made out of uh, granite to ensure they have decent decor. And once they're done with Renaissance art, art there will be marble blocks here. Also, where's the where's the plastic? I really need to set up a shading station up here. But where's where is the room for the sharing station? Rotten lettuce again, yep. Yeah. But, uh, oh wait, I missed it, but yep, these plants are done. Okay, now, one priority ladders not in the ground, just to be safe. And here. These plants aren't ripe quite yet, but they will be soon, so... No, actually, that one is okay, because I kind of want that there, there anyways. Then sweep up the lettuce, and... Oh, did you plant? Yep, good. No, wait, uh, hang on. Bad. You, you weren't really supposed to do that. Because uh, we're walk working top to bottom. Uh, no. Right to left, top to bottom, in that order. You are supposed to plant now. Although, uh, May made them. May left an issue. This guy okay, produces carbon dioxide, though not much. And still no cross burgers. Why are you like this, guys? Nope, oh, but you've finished off this guy, so I can remove this. And now I need to find a place for the pitcher pump to go. At least the one that will be fed from the water system. Because we, we have a bit of uh, excess water, so we're clearly able to do that. These two have been harvested, thus they can be removed. Please harvest this one. Just grab the lettuce. That's the research done. Nice. Now I just have to wait for the Pip to hopefully do his job and... And if he does uh, that, that'll be swell. But if not, that, that'll be annoying. Hang on, 
can I? Yep, I can overlap these guys as well. Overlapping structures is uh, nice. Though I don't know if it works for buildings they work at. But with this we can... We can actually finally remove this. Although I... It doesn't really need it just yet. But uh, with the... Like with the thing, the system I'm using now, I guess I could just hook up the excess water to... No, that would mean... No point in removing that, that wouldn't work. I need to make a deeper part for that. You planted water bead, nice. Now it's just uh, find the more water, I guess. I mean, technically, I could just. Like, I don't need the computer desk, I don't need this. Yes. Demolish all of those tiles and put a picture pump there. Simple as this. And then I would have access to water without needing to, like, immediately make one. Yeah. Not much. I have not much of interest in this area. At least not yet. Hopefully, there will be something. And down here, yada yada. Step, step is happening, step isn't. Okay, now I, I have to hook it up to the desalinator because I am starting to run a little low. But I don't know if the spawn is... Let's see. If the spawn isn't, we always have the... The manual generators to back up the system, should stuff go wrong. And... Uh... Yep, again, plastic there. I need to find a way to do this. Because I could have the sharing station, you know, up in the rafters, up in the hydrogen. Which I, you know, might do, but... They will complain. There's no doubt about that. And then I'd have to move this somewhere else on an airflow tile, which again, now I need to expand this area somehow, or just reduce the amount of critters here, that's also an option, guess I should make it harder than it needs to be, uh, nope, nothing yet, so, if you want to live, Also, this lettuce should have been swept. Now we're stacking up on different foods, but... Still no frost burgers. Oh wait, actually, now I... No, we have a... 
uh, I guess Squidward just is focusing on different stuff than to cook. Which honestly, um, shame on you, Squidward. Get back to cooking. <sighs> Got to make one of them, you know. Got to see what it looks like. Food poisoning? May. Ah, yep, there's so much system that's overloading. Which, uh, you know... No, I guess... Actually, yeah, it could have been fixed if I just did it like this and then unhooked, her, unhooked the cable. Dead wire and do this. And the final but the more shovel eggs. Nice. They'll give me a bunch of food once they're dead. I know there's a loop around. Not anymore. Oh, it, I can't like reduce the overall potential load that much. I thought it counted these machines, guess it didn't. But overall, it seems that we're doing. Alright, no, doing fine. It's a while until I have to unhook it due to too low energy production. Um, how much is there to cook on this thing? Uh, still a bunch of sleep wheat. That's a uh, planes. Explains quite a lot actually. You have the seeds, Pip. Stop. Stop being annoying. Look. There shouldn't be anything in the way. Even based on the diagrams, you should be allowed to, like, work like. Ah! Back the let's. Why did no one leave? Why did you leave it there? Well, happy Pi Day, I suppose. Three point fourteen. Oh, it's almost over. Copy settings here and to delete this boy. This one as well. Oh wait, you're not able to reach over there due to the changes. Okay. That does explain something. Hopefully... Yep, that fixes it. Goodbye! <laughs> yes, now we can build a shearing station and hopefully get some stuff out of these guys. I 
I need the plastic. And how? Actually, how is the yeah, the shaft is done? There seems to be more, but then I'd have to dig into the area. Which is uh, kind of nice and cool, so I also I'd have to dig a ton of abyss light, which is annoying. So I'd rather try to find a way around. So instead, I guess we send the next exploration. I guess. I don't know actually. I could potentially could send it up. Just need to set up the like this was sixteen, right? Yeah. Then another sixteen. This would be right beside the geyser, so maybe that would be good. Although that would uh, decimate this entire area. So instead, I mean, anyway, right? Well, would decimate the entire area, so... I think I know what I can do. We can just uh, do a little bit of trolling to whoever lives in here. <laughs> just, uh, you know, uh, unseal the roof and uh, drown them. I'll most likely have to open it up later anyways, but uh, that's a problem for another day. But so this is where I intend to excavate upwards once this part is done. Also I need... Uh, Maybe I should also dig another ventilation shaft for the oxygen. Considering the change. And yeah. What am I doing wrong? It does not comply to my designs. It should be just planting in these tiles, but it won't. And I am not entirely certain why. Hmm? Oh, yeah, it's... This is why. Some letters and refrigerated, still not fine. This truly is the lettuce colony now. Just finish off the dig. Yes. Do it, May. Brown him. Uh, it's quite possible that it will leak over, but yeah. Uh, I guess there were no way around it then. The pizza grabbed a shipping container that's flooding. What a shame. <laughs> no, yep, no, it's overflowing. In which case, I, I guess there is no problem with uh, just planning this.
I guess. I don't know. If I also mined down here, it would allow for slightly more storage. Oh, and what in the fuck? We are witnessing magic in the making. Behold. Somehow the wall up oh, now it broke. Magic is over, guys, go home. What in the fuck? Okay. Don't need to dig these because they will be broken anyways. And it's, uh, it's going to be a lot more salt water flowing down later anyways. And then we can plant the final pieces. Did somebody enter the no breathe zone or was somebody attacked? We're making frost barriers. You guys aren't allowed to eat it. <laughs> and also make sure to actually pick it up here. Excellent. Curative tablets, because we're not getting any more duplicates just yet. And the decor is, uh, it's not great, but it's not too terrible just yet. Because now we, oh, now we need to start clearing this. And this is where one thing that I have learned through experimentation could potentially be useful. Like, all debris, it sucks. For each pile of debris you get, what was it, uh... Negative, uh, negative something. You get the negative decor value for having debris on the ground. So if that's a problem, move all the debris into one single tile and try to avoid your duplicates going there as much as possible. You'll be fine. So I think that's what I'll be doing, but oh shit. They're free. But before I'm able to do that, I'll need to find a place where I can dump it. And where it won't be an issue later, because once you start dumping it, you can't stop. So, I guess I'll start off by trying to find a place to dump. Could potentially be in the industrial zone, but I don't want it too far out of the base. I mean, potentially I'll be just building housing down here. Possibly a shower area, actually. Just like um, showers, you know. Although, oh, okay, I, I want to try something here now. First we need to find the shower, that's probably on the plumbing. And let's say we want to build the shed, the, we want to build the sh Doesn't seem like you're able to just no. Shadows don't overlap. Okay. Easy test. We know. So in that case, I guess we can just make a regular shower area. And 
down. Yeah. I don't think showers are part of a special room. I'll just double check. And if not, it doesn't really matter where I how I build them. Don't have to be a max size. And oh, no, I uh, yep, the desalinator has uh, I think it has purified enough for now. But the desalinator is an unfortunate part of this spawn as it requires so much power. Hmm. Yes, more landscape, that's great. And we still haven't gotten any plastic because... Um, why haven't we gotten any plastic? I don't know, but they refuse to use the sharing station. It will be what six showers in a single room. If I do continue on with this, like the sign esque uh, that I just, you know, continue on through, then we will get to what X amounts. Nope, that's not the final room actually, um, because it will walk all the way over here. 29, okay, 14 showers in a room, or potentially less, if I maybe want to add, like, some decoration. And... All turn, let's see here. I could just like add it up to here. And yeah, that's probably what I should do. Then they can walk through the shower with, you know, not really a problem because who cares. Actually, if we do it like this, we can just, I mean, we could just have a straight line here, but I think I'd rather have it like this. And then the same with the output pipes. those through over here. Excellent. And just add files, sandstone tiles and showers. the ability to shower in the open. And who wouldn't want that? Okay. Maybe share. It's not that often. Let's just have a high priority. They'll get stuff done. That's what matters. Beyond that, the ladder over here, not, not really working on it because they don't have time.
And here, do, have you guys... You have done something. You know what? You get another tile. Anybody? Like this? Stupid. By removing the tiles. By removing the stuff, I basically halted all of the planting. Oh. Never mind, he, he actually out, oh, but unfortunately you're not allowed to do anymore until the guy above has. Oh. Yeah. Now it will take a little time before the system is the system's backlog is fixed. Because now the whole thing's empty and it needs to fill up. So whilst we are trying to get that done, maybe we should be a little more demanding. Work whenever it's below 90. And now we also have the remaining plastic. Good. I am moving myself over to the science court. Until I actually have enough for a plastic bed. In which ca in uh, at what at, at which point I'll take that. Okay, he's planted the water away as well. Good. You're slacking behind, top hip. Where is the plants that are in your way? Wait, what's up? Oh, no, the fungal spores because they've been harvested and dropped more. Okay, that makes sense. This is going good. Going good so far. Yep, the marble blocks. Okay, um, who was my artistic dude? Amari. Okay, you're soon you'll be able to actually start doing your thing. And maybe then you <laughs> will have more than just the operating tab as high priority. In the meantime, let's check for finished lettuce. Nothing over here. Here we have some. Now, yeah, I probably will need to add the lettuce harvesters above here at some point. And also, at some point, I might actually allow my duplicates to start eating lettuce. If it becomes too much. Although if they were better at cooking, maybe they'd have maybe I'd allow them to eat the prostergus. Wait. Is it maybe a strategy to not just to have all your duplicates eat the same food. Like every time I have made like a system, it's been like, ah, oh, everyone eats the same, you know. No difference, but once you become like a colony of maybe uh, 20 duplicates, 
maybe that's the time you start saying, okay, these people are important, they have many jobs, they eat better food. Maybe I should make a society in which one person eats all the good food while the rest starves. Oh, he died. Let him grab the meat. Oh yeah, it's too tight. That's why they're not getting the meat. And the... more lepus. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Can I dump something in the water? Hmm. Actually, yeah, that's what I can do. If I just decide that, oh, once this one is full, I start off shooting all the excess water into like a massive pool that I just, that's designed to be like never filled, but while slowly filling it with water, I also slowly fill it with pakus. Then that's a source of uh, seafood, and then for the low-ranking citizens, that can be the main uh, the main dish. Maybe I shouldn't make a hierarchy in this colony, but maybe it would be fun. Get to work, you slow poke. Jesus. Um, you know what? How many pips do I have on this uh, asteroid? One here. Okay, so not many. This guy just needs to stay behind so that we actually have someone working down here. Uh, so I... You know what? I guess what I'll do is wrangle those guys. Deliver them here. And then maybe they'll plant it once they're three. Not just one. One lazy pip. Oh, the lettuce. That's rotting. Beyond the point of saving. So it's nice having like so many poker shells around because it does mean that I get large amounts of free um a free lime was it? Yes, I'm going to need lime once I start making steel. And generally, it's like uh, yeah, you built up a bunch of eggshells and maybe some poke shells but it will still take some time but with this amount of poke shells it'll be a breeze like just this guy he's slowly but surely creating um poke shells by just being himself dying and having children he is uh, the average family man 
Oh wait, rock me. Okay, that's that's unacceptable. Why is there barbecue in a pit here? No, ah, oh, piss. I didn't mean to compost it. Okay, but let's see. How did it end up here? Oh yeah, people were carrying it up, and then they'd be like, "Nah, too tired." How dare you? We're building a prosperers. Uh, the okay. The limiting factor on our prosperity production seems to be frost buns, which is um, that is expected, and that's something I might have to think about. Like if I release just if I dig out a larger area of maybe not this one, but one of the other places fill it up with uh, carbon dioxide and uh, pips then they will just slowly re slowly plant and then if I get some sort of active cooling system then I'll be sure that they don't die out and yep, all the gas is cooling down to an negative uh, 60 so on its way out it's slowly cooling down the rest of the area that's excellent uh, now uh, are you going to build this or are you too busy doing other stuff It's like I see that you haven't actually... You haven't even finished it? Oh. Ah, I see. <laughs> I forgot to set it to a 1 to a 5 priority and not a 1. I guess that's what happens when you're trying to get these stupid pips to work. You're not supposed to be put here. You're supposed to be wrangled. Your destination is the top, and definitely not this area. Okay. Hopefully they'll work uh, prices fast. Or hopefully they will actually do what they're supposed to at all. That's a baseline thing. As long as they do what they're supposed to, I won't complain. But I guess that's a bit of a too high bar, isn't it? Hmm. Uh, I like a pinch of pepper plant is dying, but that's I don't care about that. So... Yeah, I think it's time to just start descending as well. Like, finish the area around the arrows here, I want to know. Then just pop. Maybe I should set it so that it's actually at five baseline, not just one. Okay. Do these guys even know that there's water weed seeds there? Because they don't seem to.
Uh, wait a minute. All this natural gas I'm seeing around the base, is that from the duplicant? Like, how much natural gas does May make? Uh, too much is the base answer, but you know. Okay, so flatulent uh, duplicates apparently make on average 10 to 2.5 grams of natural gas per second. So that might actually be something I'll have to think about, <laughs> Fix, like removing from the air at some point. Which is like, kind of stupid. <laughs> but also that means I have access to natural gas and we, how much does this use? 100 grams a second. Looking at its uh, properties. On that village, like, let's say, 50%. That means, like... Okay, we need a couple of flatulent duplicates to keep it, like, running. Maybe on 50%, but still, it, it's helping. seem to be cooling the air a little less so we're not wasting well, wasting weight and wasting heat I although I want the base to be cooler I don't need it to be oh yeah by the way this is uh, Amari's bed Maybe at some point I'll be able to afford another one. Unfortunately, they mostly <laughs> appear around 5 degrees, which it isn't. Actually, I think I want to know, like, what does Slime Link, slime link actually do? Like, is it actually a problem or is it like a... Not something I need to fear at all, really. Ba -ba. Okay, uh, so slime lang is not uh, as bad as I thought it was. Like the only thing it does is like the people need to start breathing coughing because they they don't aren't able to breathe in enough oxygen even while they're in oxygen, and they can cough up uh, more. Slime Lang, which can affect others, but like that doesn't seem like too big of an issue as long as I like make sure that those do handle slime don't spread it, I mean then I should be fine. 
Although, uh, let me just check this slime ring again. It multiplies in... No, it does not survive in liquids. Actually, it's killed by liquids, meaning that dropping slime lung into or dropping slime into polluted water might not be an issue. Let's check. Where am I storing the slime? Because I'm storing it somewhere, right? No, actually, I'm not storing the slime anywhere. In which case, uh, I guess I could try to like... No, that I won't reach. See if I can mine some slime length, just drop it into a pool and see what happens. And uh, if it uh, starts to die in the pool, I can just drop all slime and leg into a pool before removing it. Or keep it there. Both options work. Yep, pool. Here we have the slime. The germs are surrounded by... No, wait. Okay, so being surrounded by polluted water makes it multiply? What? I make it so it's... If it's around, if polluted water is around it, it multiplies, but if it's just only in the polluted water, it will die out. Okay. Does it leach out into the water? Doesn't seem to. Hmm. Maybe I should just look into making the slime link here, and then I maybe don't need to worry too much too much about handling it. Nasty suit for... Oh, Marty. But uh, finally... <laughs> finally another battle. Slightly higher priority on the bed just so that we actually get to sleep. are below the necessary temperature now. Interesting. And this... Oh, the this, this scent isn't going too well. Uh, all the things are happening which are more important. The ascent is also stagnated. I mean, I guess the we're getting frost burgers and we're getting food. We're we're decreasing on life loaf, which means that I might have to actually give them something else to eat. I need to increase the amount of lice I am me lice I'm having. Actually I'll start harvesting these because 
it's a waste to just let them rot. And if these boys really were hungry, they would have eaten them before they were at this stage. Oh. Yes. Build the ladder. And by the way, this is your bed now, meaning that the lab coat does stay empty. Oh well. Amari has mass works. Okay, the time has come. Start uh, decorating. Let's see what the first sculpture we get is. No, oh, a mermaid. Or the large ish, ish mermaid, I oh, am. Yeah. And you're also making art now. What the fuck? Connecting to the chat, what do you mean? Did I disconnect? Hmm. Ah, the Astrid at home. Oh, it's a cool achievement. Uh, oh yeah. Creating art. The hip hypothesizer. We are truly experiencing art. Let's just check around the map for germs. Oh yeah, this is slime line pocket. Pocket. I need to remember that so that I don't accidentally dig it up. This is floor scent. And what this show? Oops. Doesn't seem to be much germs I need to worry about. Except for these zombie spores. Actually, I'm gonna quickly check what those do as well. Because I actually have no idea. I just know that those are supposed to be really dangerous. Zombie spores. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, so slime lung isn't deadly. It's just really annoying. Okay, what the what the zombie spores does it essentially once it infests a duplicate, they lose ten on every attribute for the for eighteen cycles. Which is bad. You don't want that. But it's also not lethal, which is nice. Guess it. You. You, you. Oh. Fine. What you gonna do? Let me do that one. 
You're gonna plant something now, huh? I hope you don't. But if you do, I'll be disappointed. Wait. Okay, you weren't stuck. Um, okay, there's a spare glossy directed egg, so start, uh, start doing that one. Yep. In next cycle, they'll finish the showers, probably. Yeah, it's just leaking into this one. Okay, that's that's not good. <laughs> just clogging up the output pipe of another one. And the corn, nice. Maximum in every tile. Almost. So now the quorum is supposed up. Uh, although I need to fix this because it's not good. Terrible, if I may, so, may say so. Hydrogen. It is hydrogen, right? Yeah. It's around 20 degrees, which is cold enough, but uh, maybe I need to keep an eye on this still. Hmm. Up oh, now. Now the showers are usable. And the back. Wait, whoa, I, I did not think about that. It doesn't run at all if this battery isn't uh, charged. And it doesn't charge if. Uh, if it doesn't receive hydrogen, you know. That's... I did not think about that, but... We felt like a loop, like, feeding power back into the system. It's going to be real problematic if it were to actually run out of hydrogen. I think it's time I set up an emergency solution. So, let's say... A gas shut off. Okay, let's just say we only feed the top anyways. Now we set up an automation system so that we... I'm not going to like link it to the pipes just yet. Well, maybe I should. Because uh, I could just say, oh, if the pipe doesn't contain any, uh, doesn't contain any hydrogen at this point, you should definitely start filling the pipes up. Actually, yeah, I think that's a reasonable demand of this system. And then I can just then I just add the switch for like overriding. Overriding. If I know I'm, if I know I want to fill it up more, then I'll just put put it on. And with this, I can also remove this pile of junk. Hmm. 
No. Det är det du har. Du har mest. A lot of sleet of it to harvest though. Of um temperature. Fuck if this melts I'm going to have to crack open the door and grab all the sleet wheat. I don't want to lose large amounts of sleet wheat. Yes, um, again, none of this system is vital, so it's okay that it cracked, but it's not okay that it cracked here. Okay, I, I kind of don't want to update like most of the system, but I also kind of have to, especially now that I'm creating a feedback loop overriding the system. Oh shit. Oh, but wait a minute. Um, there and uh, do I have to place it like this? Okay, yeah, that this works. So that way I'll still have the system running. That's important. And it's just waiting for the lead delivery, which could take some time. Actually, none of this system is vital because it it's unable to pick it up anyways. I need one where it just peels in on its own. In that case, it wouldn't be stupid. It wouldn't be dumb. It could actually be quite clever. Could well, smart. So uh, how's it going here? Uh, you haven't done anything. You guys are useless. I am ashamed of you. Now oh, how do I fix this? Do I like say, ah, you are not allowed to do is it anything in this room until I, unless I say otherwise. See how you like this, getting stuck in a small cramped room full of ladders. Is this going to make you do something else? I don't think it will, but please. Please just do. Oh, and this, I mean, this is, doesn't really matter. Okay, now this is a problem. Now these systems have uh, disconnected. Which shouldn't happen. Hmm. May I don't think you're going to be able to lift it up and do you drop it again? No. Oh well, made it. So I'm going to have to fix this somehow. Um. Ah. 
I don't know exactly how to do this. I guess like one option is just to say, yeah, put all the lead you find in this bin and then the, you can grab the lead out of there when you're building stuff. If it is hydrogen. What? Uh, you are only allowed to take hydrogen. I'm going a little further, it seems. As well as down. But, uh, yep, this one. Refined mineral lead, ninth priority. Then hopefully people will start just dropping it off there. And just destroy the... All, like, low-tier cable that's not used for anything. Destroy, oh. I'm going to be forced to update the system, especially if I'm going to f need to fill this back up with hydrogen. I know actually I needed that. I also need the power cable. Oopsie. Hmm. Now that the core is doing great. We just need uh, to remove the debris. May please. If you're not able to deliver, can you just stop trying? You're wasting everyone's time. And may you're scolding now because you are done. You know what, May? I thought better of you, but turns out you are not prepared for the real world. It's time for you to get back on the treadmill. I am sorry, but it's just the way things are. Oh. Can't you guys, like, Clean up after yourselves. Stop leaving food waste on the floor. Oh well. I think most of the lead is being picked up. A lot more efficient. And it also means that I'm going to be able to actually ask you to please upgrade. <laughs> then this, destroy those cables. destroy the rest. And just set every construction action in the base 
too high priority. And damn me. I don't remember what you were supposed to do. You got high science, so I guess that's what you got going for yourself. Uh. You can become a doctor. Maybe you can start taking care of our patients. Yeah, no, it's sad. Just the way that the things are. Ah, no rotten lettuce. Or at least it's food for these guys. Stick around and grab the fresh lettuce. And down here we have a bit of uh, sweet wheat. Good. Here we have even more. These guys still haven't done what they're supposed to. You have been very, very bad at doing your job. And I don't even know if it would be better if you went down and did it. Well, there's an aid there, so maybe we'll just check. Um. Also need to connect this. But please just finish the power wire construction, it's quite important and you have all the materials easy at hand. That's what the point of the box is. Just set this to red, it doesn't matter. Uh, no wait, um... Now it's set to allow. Oh yeah, I'm going to need to install a... Uh, a I don't have it researched yet, really? No, I'll get back to it later. I need to research a not gate so that I can actually build the system correctly, because I hadn't. And my god, oh, there is a lot of natural gas here. Jeez, there is natural gas in here as well? Oh, that's right, um, I didn't think about it, but May can't control herself when she's uh, creating natural gas, so I can't risk having her in there at all. It's although it was, luckily it was just a small amount, but too much and it could really mess up the system. No, I can't, I need to keep her out of there. Yeah. I think that's going to be it for today. We have been, I've been streaming for a couple of hours now. So I think this is good enough. We, we got a bunch of, we got a bunch of stuff done. And uh, our system is not the best yet. But it works, and I think it's more or less able to keep the base running. 
build system is going fine, the pip are just a lot less effective than I'd hoped. So, so yeah, I guess we'll get back to this next time and see if we can fix it. When next time is going to be, that's another question, and there will be more oxygen not included in the future. I, I will attempt to get to the wormhole, but uh, yep, yeah, that's going to take some time, and that's going to have to be another time. Goodbye.